Molar Attenuation Coefficient, Wikipedia Article Audio The molar attenuation coefficient is a measurement of how strongly a chemical species attenuates light at a given wavelength. It is an intrinsic property of the species. The SI unit of molar attenuation coefficient is the square meter per mole, but in practice, it is usually taken as the M1CM1 or the L-mole1CM1. In older literature, the CM2-mole is sometimes used with corresponding values 1000 times larger. In practice these units are the same with the difference being expression of volume in either CM3 or in L. The molar attenuation coefficient is also known as the molar extinction coefficient and molar absorptivity, but the use of these alternative terms has been discouraged by the IUPAC. The absorbance of a material that has only one attenuating species also depends on the path length and the concentration of the species according to the Beer-Lambert law. Where Different disciplines have different conventions as to whether absorbance is decadic or Napierian, i.e., defined with respect to the transmission via common logarithm or a natural logarithm. The molar attenuation coefficient is usually decadic. When ambiguity exists, it is best to indicate which one applies. When there are n attenuation species in a solution, the overall absorbance is the sum of the absorbances for each individual species I. The composition of a mixture of n attenuating species can be found by measuring the absorbance at n wavelengths. The wavelengths chosen are usually the wavelengths of maximum absorption for the individual species. None of the wavelengths must be an isospecific point for a pair of species. The set of the following simultaneous equations can be solved to find the concentrations of each attenuating species. The molar attenuation coefficient is directly related to the attenuation cross-section via the Avogadro constant Na. The mass attenuation coefficient is equal to the molar attenuation coefficient divided by the molar mass. In biochemistry, the molar attenuation coefficient of a protein at 280 nm depends almost exclusively on the number of aromatic residues, particularly tryptophan, and can be predicted from the sequence of amino acids. Similarly, the extinction coefficient of nucleic acids at 260 nm can be predicted given the nucleotide sequence. If the molar attenuation coefficient is known, it can be used to determine the concentration of a protein in solution. Epsilon is the molar attenuation coefficient of that material, C is the molar concentration of those species, is the path length.